Uncertainty is a part and parcel of human life. None of us know what is in future holding for us. However, we all plan for the unseen, for the unknown, or some kind of calamity or tragedy that might strike us. But how do we calculate it? How do we analyze the risk is the next question. Do we really analyze it? Can we really calculate the risk or know the unknown? Yes, there is a profession for this too. I'm talking about actuarial sciences. Welcome to Career Growth. Today's episode highlights on actuarial sciences. An old field, however, not known to many. Something which raises eyebrows. What is this all about? Is this something related to science? What is this actuary? Who is an actuary? Do we really need actuarial science people? Well, the answer to it is we do need them. Actuaries are business professionals who help in assessment, measurement and management of risk and uncertainty. To start with, it is the study of applications that apply mathematical and statistical methods to assess risk management in insurance, finance and other industries. With the advent of new insurance companies coming up, international insurance companies coming to India, as well as the amount of uncertainty that lies ahead of us gives birth to an important profession. Actual Sciences gives umpteen opportunities for the young and talented. So how does one become or how does one get into actuarial sciences? To become an actuarial science person, one needs to have keen interest in mathematics and statistics to begin with. The training starts right after class 12th. However, if you have work experience in the insurance sector, it adds to it. One has to clear certain papers and get into the licenses part of it. Once you are a license holder, you can practice as an actuary either as a freelance person or join an insurance company by itself. Well, a few universities have started an undergraduate program itself in actual sciences. That itself brings to the note that it is an upcoming field. One can become a BSc in actual sciences and also further on study till an MBA level. Yes, that's what it is. The Actual Society of India too conducts the programs or I would say the levels or the papers. One has to clear all those levels and become an actuary. In addition, if you are a graduate in mathematics and statistics and love working with numbers and have a great analytical skill, can also opt for further postgraduate programs in actuarial studies. But to actually work as an actuary, you will have to pass a series of actuarial exams. Studying actuarial science only provides you the theoretical knowledge and the conceptual clarity. However, to work as an actuary, you need to enroll with the Institute of Actuaries of India or the Actuarial Society of India and clear the Actuarial Common Entrance Test. Once enrolled as a student actuary, you will have to appear for 15 subject exams before you become eligible to be admitted as a fellow member of the society and can use the credentials FSAI against your name as a recognized fellow. Along with the educational qualification, one definitely needs to have a certain skill set like analytical mind, great communication skills, computer knowledge, interpersonal skills, and definitely a problem solving skills. Once you are designated as an actuarial science person or an actuary, there are a lot of job openings awaiting you. They could be in consultancy firms, in educational institutions, enterprise risk management, finance, foreign banks, general insurance, government sector, health and care insurance, investment sector, life insurance, pensions and other employee benefits, private insurance companies, reinsurance companies, and so on. The actuarial profession is a blend of professional and educational experience. One can actually make a career in a long way while deciding the premiums, the risks involved in any kind of unseen calamity. I hope that this information will help you to determine whether actuarial sciences is just meant for you or not. Keep watching. Keep subscribing, career growth. Thank you.